Hi everyone! In this video, I'm going to show you the 10 most awesome Linux distros. My name is Lauren, and this channel is all about showing you how to become a highly paid IT pro fast. Let's get started. Linux is one of the most diverse operating systems in the world, and it gives you an unprecedented level of control and customization. Thanks to its open source nature, there are thousands of Linux distributions. Distro hopping has become a thing in Linux communities. To make it easier for you to find a Linux distro that's suitable for you, we have compiled a list of some of the best Linux distributions out there. This list has something for everyone. If you are a pro and looking for highly advanced distros which you can customize, there are distros for you in this video. If you are a Windows user but want a Linux flavor that is easy and fun to use, you will find plenty of options here. Gobo Linux. Gobo Linux makes it to the list of top 10 most awesome distros because of its file system. Gobo Linux organizes programs in your computer in a logical fashion. Each program in Gobo Linux is assigned a directory tree. This Linux distro doesn't need a package database because the file system is the database. Gobo Linux uses the file system for indexing. Whenever a file is needed, instead of scanning hundreds of program entries, Gobo Linux uses a series of directories containing symbolic links pointing to the actual files. This also gives increased visibility into relationships between packages and files. Gobo Linux also achieves optimization through this core mechanism. All references to files that don't exist anymore become automatically inactive. This makes it possible to ensure 100% synchronization between indexing and the actual system. Crux Crux is one of the most popular Linux distros and is famous for its simplicity and lightweight architecture. The distribution is based on the tar.gz based package system, BSD style init scripts, and a few trimmed packages. This distro also uses the ports system, which makes it easier for users to install and upgrade applications. Crux is ideal if you package a lot of software. Package management in this Linux distro is done through several tools that are very easy to script. In Crux, you can make customized packages exactly the way you want, with complete control of your systems. Crux uses sysvinit as a default init system. However, it's slightly difficult to remove dependencies in Crux after uninstalling a package. Beginner users will find the distro slightly difficult to set up, mainly because of its bare bones structure. Even though there aren't very many ports available in Crux, you can write your own ports very easily. It's also worth noting that the Crux community is extremely friendly, knowledgeable, and supportive. Linux Mint Linux Mint is one of the most popular Linux distros, especially for beginners. This distribution of Linux is based on Debian and comes with many free and open source software applications. Linux Mint is known for being very user friendly and stable. Linux Mint users rarely complain about crashes or unexpected errors. The most frequent comment you'd read in reviews is, it just works. The distribution offers required functionality without bloating the UI and system with non-essential or complex features which the common user doesn't need. Even non-tech individuals who are just getting started with Linux can easily install and set up Linux Mint. Linux Mint is famous for its smooth and quick detection of external devices without needing manual driver installation. It is suitable for beginner Linux users who are migrating from Windows. Mint has all the traditional Windows-like features and design, including a start menu and keyboard shortcuts. Mint has several desktop environments, but the most popular is Cinnamon. Cinnamon has several desktop effects, transition effects, main menus, launchers, adjustable system trays, and various extensions. You can also perform a lot of customization using the setting editor. Manjaro Manjaro is an open source Linux distribution based on Arch Linux. Manjaro stands out in situations where you need a stable OS that has few hardware compatibility issues. 
It is a rolling release distro, so you need to be careful when updating your system. Don't just install any update. Read the distro's forum in detail to ensure that the update is stable and will work. Manjaro is fairly easy to set up and install, and it's recommended for people coming from a Windows background because of its stark resemblance to the Windows UI. It is lightweight and uses the popular Pac-Man package manager. This distro also automatically scans your system for any drivers to be installed. Manjaro is also famous for its kernel management. It remains up to date with the latest kernel, including release candidates. You can also switch in between different kernels very easily. Manjaro's community is vast and talented, and you will find a plethora of applications made by Manjaro developers which aren't available in other repos. Zorin Zorin is often recommended if you want the look and feel of Windows or Mac, but at the same time enjoy the power of Linux. Some notable features of this Linux distro include clean, simple yet beautiful interface, customization, and ease of use for beginners. It also supports touch interface. The design maximizes space for apps and commonly accessed content, along with a plethora of gestures to make everything feel seamless. Zorin offers a variety of UIs and modes to customize the interface and design of your desktop. For example, in Zorin 15, the most famous version of the distro, you can use dynamic wallpapers on your screen that change based on the time of the day. Zorin, which is based in Ubuntu, is also extremely useful if you want optimized usage of your system resources, especially in gaming. Zorin users have experienced a considerable increase in their laptop battery life as compared to other distros and operating systems. Zorin OS also has a powerful games finder which you can use to find thousands of games free to download. Fedora a well-known Linux distro, Fedora makes it to the list of the most awesome Linux distros because of its focus on free software and stability. Fedora is also known for its security and you can install updates with confidence. Updates are released roughly every six months. This regular update cycle makes Fedora an up-to-date distro with continuous new features and security revamps. Fedora is based on Red Hat Scent OS and it uses DNF-based package management, which makes the distro fast and easy to learn. This Linux distro comes with the vanilla genome UI, which is beautiful and gives you more control over the look and feel of your desktop. Fedora has one of the largest and strongest communities, as it's owned by Red Hat, the largest paid contributor to the genome desktop. Fedora provides a lot of open source software, you can also install RPM Fusion repositories to install third-party software. Some users complain about the slowness of Fedora in high-performance environments, but this is mainly due to strict security standards programmed into the kernel. Elementary OS Elementary OS is a notable Linux distro that is based on Ubuntu LTS. It uses the Pantheon desktop environment which stands out because of its simplicity and features. The environment has a lot of structure to it, which makes performing common tasks much faster. Users can lock the dock at the bottom of the screen to access shell extensions. Pantheon aligns horizontally, which increases productivity for many. You can also run GTK themes, including Elementary X theme, ePapyrus icons, and Capitan cursors. This Linux distro is awesome for beginners. If you are coming from Windows, starting with elementary OS would be a feasible option. You won't have to access the terminal because the UI of the system gives you a lot of control. The App Center takes care of all of the updates. Gen 2 Linux Gen 2 Linux is based on the Portage package management system, in which the source code is compiled locally based on user preferences. Gen 2 gives a lot of control over libraries and features for packages. It's also very easy to add a patch or to edit a package. The distro offers use flags, which can be used to disable the features which you don't need. Gen 2 offers a lot of customization for servers. If you are a Linux enthusiast and want to know how the OS actually works, Gen 2 is for you. 
Using Gen 2, your command line knowledge will increase exponentially. If customizing an OS and software specifically for your laptop sounds fun to you, you will have a great time using this distro. Gen 2 also offers bleeding edge versions of applications. However, this distro is not for everyone, especially beginners. Gen 2's compile time is slow. In the case of dependency problems and conflicts with use flags or package masks, you will have to dig deeper and resolve the issues yourself. Kubuntu. Kubuntu is an amalgam of Ubuntu, KDE, and Plasma Desktop. The initial versions of Kubuntu were unstable and had several bugs. But the distro has come a long way and its most recent version is much more stable and easy to use. Plasma trackpad control increases productivity in day-to-day -day tasks. Kubuntu was built with QT Toolkit. The distro is fast, mobile ready, and offers easy and seamless integration with PC desktop, phone, or tablet. Package management is also easy in Kubuntu. You can use the Discover GUI Package Manager from KDE for the Plasma desktop. You can find new programs, see package details, see user reviews, check apt sources, and see firmware updates for different packages. Kubuntu is also recommended for gaming enthusiasts. For example, Kubuntu 20.04 LTS provides a solid KDE experience. You can switch between different graphics cards. This distro also has a strong community because it's based on Ubuntu. Void Linux. Void Linux is based on the X binary package system, X BPS package manager, and run it in its system. Void makes it to the list of top 10 most awesome Linux distros because of its speed, Libre SSL instead of Open SSL, OpenBSD's Mandoc instead of Mandoc, fast package management, and clean interface. The init system is logical and very easy to use. Because of its roots in the BSD community, the distro runs like a charm without forcing its users to learn the difficult functions of the backend. It's a rolling release distro with up-to-date packages and proven stability. Void Linux also has a strong community and support. Check out the video on the right for more videos to help you develop your IT career.